happening when it was recording? Okay. Okay, now it's recording. Our, let's see if we have the echo. Are we good? Looks like it. Everybody give a thumbs up if it's if it's not echoing on your end. Okay. Sounds great. Okay, all right. Well, you know what? We're gonna try this again. Good morning, everybody. We are recording. We had a little bit of a glitch, so uh, we're back on track. Today is uh, Monday, December the 6th, and can't believe 2021 is almost over. Um, welcome to our Live Younger community, where we get to come together every Monday morning and share our excitement, our enthusiasm, our love, our appreciation for, for Robin and Gregory, no, excuse me, not Robin and Greg, for the patches and Robin and Gregory, because <laughs> they're wonderful. We love Robin and Gregory. And we love David Schmidt and LifeWave. And um, we have a new patch on, on board, the X49. And uh, we don't certainly have to just limit our ca call to that. But if anyone has something to share about the X49, that would be fun. I will definitely share something. So just to give you the um, parameters for the meeting that we share every, every Monday, Karen, uh, Karen O'Neill and myself, Michelle Niels, we, sh we share, we co-host these Monday morning chats. And um, we want to be sure to let everyone know that we do not, the, the patches do not diagnose, treat, prevent, um, cure any disease or disease condition. So it's really, really important. So we stay compliant that we um, stick with symptoms only. So do not name any disease names. And so when you share, uh, speak about how you felt before, which patches you used, and then how you feel now. And um, so I'm just going to share really quickly. I am feeling very grateful and very happy because I sustained a pretty bad shoulder injury. I don't know the extent of it because I'm going to see an orthopedic surgeon tomorrow. Um, and I don't want to name names anyway, um, because I don't want to put that in my consciousness of what might be going on. But I hurt my right shoulder last weekend lifting a five gallon water bottle several times off the shelf into the cart out of the cart into the car and then out of the car into the garage and I did something and I wasn't able to move my arm and the pain was like a nine out of ten and um I have been patching yesterday was a twelve dollar patch day <laughs> on my shoulder I just had just like wallpaper all over my arm my shoulder and um this morning I woke up and Oh my gosh, there's like almost no pain. I mean, if I move it, there's a little bit of discomfort, but I wasn't able to, I was not able to do this the other day, you guys. Like I was not able to lift my arm up to the side. I was not able to lift it up to the front and it's moving in all directions. <laughs> this is huge. I mean, a, seriously, nine out of 10 pain. I thought I tore something. So I'm still seeing a doctor tomorrow, but um, I'm going to keep patching because some of you may have heard Dr. Jeff um, share about, he was a baseball player, I guess, and he sustained a rotator cuff injury. And um, he used only the X39 for three months. And in three months, he was completely healed. So I just want to say, especially for people who are new, you know, often we have a very quick experience, especially with Ice Wave and, in a, and even with X39, where we have instant or very rapid relief of pain or a condition. But sometimes it takes time. I mean, if some injury has been going on for a while, it may take a few months. And I've been using the patches now for a week on this particular injury. And I would say it feels about 80% better. And I'm going to just keep going no matter what the doctor says tomorrow. I'm going to keep patching and just keep it going. And I'll share you guys, share with you all my, uh, my progress. So there's one story to start. I'm very grateful, very, very grateful. And X49, by the way, Helen loaned me a few patches and I, I put that right on the point of most pain. And, um, and it, I'm, I'm really making some, some good progress. So that's our first story. Who would like to bless our community? As Karen O'Neill says, who would like are, to share? Are you wearing those 12 hours on, 12 hours off? Yes, yes. And I did Eon at night because I always wear Eon at night. Um, so Eon at night, uh, my Ala Vida, my Silent Night, and all the other patches during the day. I'm talking Ice Wave, X39, X49, Carnosine. Um, yeah, my, my shoulder was completely patched up. 
So yeah, who's next? You can either raise your hand. Um, there's an there's a icon at the bottom of your screen that says reactions and you can press the raise hand button um, or you can wave and I might see you. So it looks like Ali, you have your hand up. So go ahead and unmute Ali and we'd love to hear from you. Hey, um, it's been 10 years today since I had brain surgery that took out some nerves and the neurosurgeon said I'd never be able to do this. He said, I'd never go higher than here. This. And also I had numbness in more than half my mouth. It was like having a pillow in my mouth. And since I've been using the patches, I have feeling, I was so excited. I had my teeth cleaned and I felt everything she was doing on that side of my mouth. And all my friends are telling me they now understand when I speak because it was very hard to talk clearly. So I am so grateful, so grateful. Allie, is that the X39 mostly or you've been consistently using or, or which patch? No, I, I am, uh, I test everything every day before I use it. So there are days when I don't use anything. Um, mostly what I use is the, X39, the X49, I sleep with the A on and it, it's absolute. And sometimes I use carnosine or glutathione. And when I hurt, cause I had also hurt my shoulder, um, those ice waves, <laughs> so yeah. Yay, all oh, beautiful. Thank you, Allie, thank you. And by the way, um, Kay is next, but I wanted to just say if anyone is new on this call today, um, or even in the last couple of weeks, and you haven't um, introduced yourself, um, we would love to give you a, a very warm Live Younger welcome. So please, um, if you're comfortable, let us know that you're new and where you're from. Um, okay, Kay, go ahead and unmute and Good morning, everyone. I'm going to quote directly from a text that I received from Dr. Bruce, whom I've sponsored into the company. He says, quote, I had serious residual fatigue and lightheadedness sensation since being in bed for two weeks with that virus. I was worried about how I was going to handle work this week. I put on X49 only because I wanted to see how it would work by itself. And the next morning, I had no lightheadedness sensation, and I worked all day with no, in capital letters, fatigue. So um, imagine what would have happened if he'd used X49 with X39 to get those results with it just by itself. So that's my testimonial. And now that I have the mic, I'd like to ask a question of the group. Does anyone have any uh, results with the patches with allergies. It's allergy season in Arizona and lots of people are suffering and love to use the patches for it. Okay, let's put that out to the community. Has anyone- on... I have a story. Who is this? Story. Who's speaking? This is Jonna, I'm on the phone. I'm sorry, I'm not hi, on jo Zoom. Hi, hi Jonna. Hi. hi. Well, actually I have a few stories, but um, I usually get terrible mm -hmm. allergies. I live in Arizona, and when the when allergy season you. hits, it covers, you know, we have yellow pollen all over our cars and everything. And the last two allergy seasons, I haven't had anything. So I'm really excited. I've been using X39 for two and a half years now. Um, but I wanted to say something about X49, too, if I may, right now. Um, I have a I have a neighbor who had taken a loan of ten thousand dollars out to get both of his knees uh, shot up with stem cells, and after two months he was still on crutches. And then I discovered X thirty nine, so I said, "You got to try this, Jim. You got to try it." So he did, and he within a week and a half, two weeks, he was off of crutches. So he was doing great, but he still had, you know, he still had some pain all along, even though he was much better. Well, now that he's been using X49 with the X39, he 
told me that he's been, the pain in his knees is much, much better. So I was really excited about, about that. And then I want to kind of challenge everybody to do a little experiment. If you lie down and just relax and then take the X49 and put it over your the middle of your chest or a little further down, just move it up and down the middle of your core. See what you feel. What I feel is all my cells start humming. And I actually have named it my OM patch. <laughs> it was, everything's going OM. And when David said that this really worked uh, as a relaxation response as well, I realized that that's, that was what he was talking about, was this feeling that just can go through your whole body. But you have to pay attention. You can't be running around when you use it. You just lie down, take the patch in the morning, and just move it up and down your body. Let it, let it sit in different places, even over the, your third eye. And you may notice some really interesting things. Oh, that's wonderful, Jonna. Thank you for sharing. You know, and we all could do well to take a pause Take a, take a pause, a stress break in our day. I mean, if, if, mm-hmm. if we don't have three, four or five minutes to just stop, then we have way too much going on and <laughs> just stop and just feel <laughs> what these patches are doing mm-hmm. instead of just slapping on and just, I mean, sometimes we'll have days where we do have to do that because we're off to, you know, off to the races, but that's a wonderful suggestion to move it around and just see how it feels. Increase our intuition about where to place it too. Thanks for those. Yeah. Things. Yeah. Beautiful. <laughs> Thank you. And you know what? I wanted to continue with Kay for just a minute because you asked about allergies. So, Jonna, did you you only use the X39 to help your allergies or was there another uh, patch or protocol that you used to help with allergies? I I wasn't thinking of, I was hoping that the X39 would work, but I use probably most of the patches, (laughs) I have to say. And it's been over the last couple of years, so. Okay. Um, Okay. Yeah, I just, it definitely did something for my whole immune system. Okay, thanks. Is there anyone else, before we go to Carl, is there anyone else that would like to just add a quick two cents to Kay's question about allergies? Does, has anyone had experience with, uh, I don't know if that's a diagnosis, with watery eyes, runny nose, that type of thing, you know, pollen sensitivities. Does anyone else have something to share before we take the next hand raised? Michelle Eon is always great. Okay, Dr. Tom and then Dr. Barbara. Dr. Tom, you said Eon? Yeah, I want to hear what Dr. Barbara has to say, actually. Eon's always great, but you know, any any insensitivity and any allergy and hyperreactivity is an uh, underlying immune issue. And so, you know, Eon sort of You're, you're cutting out, Dr. Tom. I, I'm, I'm not hearing you. I heard Eon, but I didn't hear the rest of what you said. Um, Dr. Barbara, what, would you, what were you going to say? I agree with Dr. Tom. I was going to say the same thing. Just uh, aller- allergies are, are an overreactive um, immune system. So the, the two I would focus on, besides X39, of course, is Eon and glutathione. Decrease inflammation in the body. That's what I would and, say. And the, yeah, the Eon patch helps modulate or you know regulate balanced immune system function. Okay, thank you, Dr. Barbara and Dr. Tom. All right, Carl, you are next. You go ahead and unmute and we'd love to hear what you have to share. Um, you know, still new to the family, <clears throat> excuse me, of Lightwave. I'm excited that Margaret is on the call here. She signed up this week and uh, we're building a team here in Southern Manitoba. I had a question from one of the uh, distributors more established in the area. They had been suggesting that people leave their initial patch on for 24 hours. And I I wanted to ask the group if if that's advisable. I can almost see it in a sense of often with doctor's prescriptions, you get a double dose at the front. I wondered uh, what the consensus in the group is on letting that patch stay on for 24 hours, just the initial one. Let me address that, Carl. Uh, I think if you're only sampling somebody one patch, it's okay. 
but I don't think there's a need to leave the leave it on the first time for 24 hours if they've got three, five, or 30 patches. However, if you're only sampling one, you're mailing it to somebody, hey, let them get all the juice out of it because the body's not going to attenuate to it in one day. So I think it's fine to wear it for it, from a test basis for one day, 24 hours, but not consistent as we know. Yeah, it's the attenuation that you're trying to avoid where the body's no longer being stimulated, correct? Correct. Thank you. Yeah. Thanks, uh, uh, Gregory. Great question. That. It's good for people to know that. I personally do recommend people leave the first patch on for 24 hours. There's no reason to take it off so quickly and they <laughs> have a better chance of getting results maybe. Excellent. I love that, Gregory. Thank you. Great question, Carl. Mm -hmm. All right. And there was someone in the chat early on when I asked for new people and it's Julianne. Julianne. Um, so welcome, Julianne. This is her second week on the call. She's from, I, mean, I don't know. Which... I'm from Burns, Tennessee. Tennessee. All right. Yes. Welcome, Julianne. Welcome to our community. We Thank love you. welcoming new people. All right. So Natural Healing Clinic is next. And then Michelle Garrett. Um, you need to unmute yourself. And, and please Hi, my apology. It's Manal. My apology. I normally I don't like to change, keep it changing the name. Um, I hear one of the videos, I believe, Dr. Nicholas, he uh, allowed us to advise to use it 12 hours and it 12 hours with the partner as far as the batches work 24 hours. So can I use it at 12 hours myself, 12 hours my husband, or at 12 hours myself? and then six hour, one of my children who are <laughs> less than 11 years old, taken into consideration, they have a condition which is make a chronic fatigue disorder. All right, your child is under 11, you said, or is 11? One under 11 and the other one is uh, 14 years old. I'm using the batches for them. And to be honest, uh, I'm satisfied, especially with their sleep and with the less of a stress, more polite, more calm. And is it just the X39 that you're using? Uh, no, we use, uh, uh, my, me and my husband, Ion uh, Karunasin. One of us use it at the night. And the other one use uh, X39, glucothine, and uh, sometimes uh, Alivida. Okay. So this question comes up often on the calls and um, it's a good one. And it's about how long does the patch last? And as Gregory said, you know, that first patch, and I love what you said, Gregory, if you're sampling someone, I'm going to start sharing that with my people that I sample, like just go ahead and you leave it for 24 hours. In, um, Monal, is that your name? I'm, I'm, I'm not sure I heard yes, your name. Monal, you're Monal. right. Um, so, the, the company and David Schmidt guarantees the patch will work for 12 hours. Absolutely, it's got all the juice. But it's, it's like one of the other doctors, uh, Dr. Shauna Young said, the, the patch is like a battery and the body is like an appliance. And so some appliances draw more from battery than other appliances, right? And so little bodies like children and animals, they may not draw as much out of the patch. But there are crystals in that, there's a crystal matrix, it's nano crystals and you know, amino acids and sugars, et cetera. So that's in the patch in the center and it melts, you know, your body heat will melt that. So it's not gonna last indefinitely, but you know, many people can get more than 12 hours. So we say, if you wanna take it off yourself and put it on a child or put it on a pet, but as far as you and your husband sharing, I don't know about that because both sure, of you- I, No, I'm not with my husband, but normally me and my husband, now my husband and children abroad. So I said, if, if it is work, it's better, if it doesn't work, at least not to waste it. Not to waste it. So in other words, putting it on, on one, of the, one of the children. Exactly. Yeah. Hey, yeah. Michelle, it's Helen. Yes. I just want Helen. to add something. David doesn't recommend re-wearing the patch. So our solution is to put it on top of one of the patches that we wear. You know, we wear ours at night, take them off, and then put it on one of the patches that we wear in the day, right on top of a patch. Because he talks about the bacteria on the skin. So he doesn't recommend it. A way around it is pancaking. 
I agree. I remember I hear this meeting, but my point, I know how clean we are. I know how much we wash. So you're right, hygiene wise, if you know that you sweat, if you know you didn't take shower today, I don't feel it's fair to give it to your partner or to your child. I agree with you, but in the end, uh, it's better to squeeze the good in it and take all of the good on it instead of with it. Yes. Put it on clothes. And you can put it on clothes. And I was never insinuating anybody wasn't clean, but I was just um, just sharing what David said, just so you know. <laughs> yeah, make sure, make sure your skin is clean when you apply the patch anyway. I mean, you know, we all sweat and not necessarily shower every single day. So just if you make sure your, your area is clean where you're going to apply the patch. Did that answer your question, Monal? 100%. Thank okay. you. Wonderful. Thank you. Michelle Garrett, you're next. I, uh, when I first started X49, about the first three times I used it, it made me real sleepy. And that's the same thing X39 did when I started it a couple of years ago. But then I got used to it and I wore it to the gym the other day. I've been going to Osteo Strong. I'm 73 and I want to help, you know, prevent any kind of bone loss. And I had my best performance ever on the bench press type machine that we do. My previous best was 377 pounds. And with X49, I did 458 pounds. And the trainer kind of, his mouth kind of dropped over. He looked at me and thought, wow, he was really shocked. And I was really shocked. I don't think that actually, I don't know if it actually um, means I could bench press that much, but it's a machine that simulates that. And I thought it was going to be really wonderful because David had said it might, they're wondering if it might help with bone growth. And I learned that the reason our bones um, lose density is because they can't be any stronger than our muscles and tendons or our muscles and tendons would snap our bones. So I thought that was an interesting fact. So I'm really happy with the fact that it, it pushed me up that much. And I did 840 pounds with my legs. I forgot to look at what it was before. But I'm pretty shocked. I mean, I'm not a very active person. I'm 73. And so I'm very pleased with it to start with here. Wow. <laughs> That's fabulous. I don't know what percent that increase that is, but that blows my mind. You say bench press. That's with that's the arms, right? You're laying down and you're pressing up. Well, this is a machine that Tony Robbins invented. And you're sit in a sitting position and you're pushing forward in the same position you would be if you were lying down doing a bench press. Okay. And they tell me it's the same. I can't imagine that I could do that much. I mean, it, it doesn't com compute in my mind, <laughs> but um, it's the same movement and the same pushing forward. And you're only doing it for like maybe 15 seconds. It's, and that's the, the way these machines are designed is to put maximum pressure on your bones and your muscles for just a very short period of time. And they only have to do it once every, every week. And then you have the healing process in between for your bones and muscles to recover and regenerate. So that's whether it's actually a bench press or not, I don't know. They say it's similar, but um, it was a lot of weight for me. And I was really happy to have had that good score. <laughs> Michelle, my go goodness, if you can get a picture, someone take a picture of you and post that on our Vibrant Living. Um, I'm sure many of us would love to send that to uh, our um, baby boomer friends and say, look, look, look what can happen for you with, <laughs> with these wonderful okay. light, light therapy patches. Okay, I'll take a picture next week. That, that'd be awesome. Thanks, Michelle. You're welcome. Ravel. Hello, Ravel. Hi, good morning, Abby, Michelle. And um, just really quickly, because we're almost at 30 minutes. Um, I'm going to deviate a little bit. First of all, mention I cannot wait till X49 is available in Canada because I definitely felt that strength and stamina as well, pretty well immediately. Um, but I just want to mention I had a wonderful eight hour sleep using sleeping a silent nights the other day. Just wanted to point that out. And also to welcome Donna of Ontario. If you're here, it's great as always to see Sherry Young of California and Jacqueline Smith Tepes of uh, New York. It's great to see you here. And Jim, if you're here, <coughs> have a wonderful day. Thanks, Ravel. Yeah, I mean, the, the importance of good sleep. Where did you place the uh, Silent Night, Ravel? I'm curious, because there's like three or four locations. Where'd you put it? Um, I put it um, actually right, um, Vegas Nerve. And, That's uh, 
Pardon me, James of New Jersey, not of New York. Uh, yeah, so I also sometimes put it on my third eye, but it seems to work really well near my ear and vagus nerve. Okay. I actually used my silent nights there last night and I got a better sleep. That seems to, you know, I, I want to tell people experiment. Like, you know, if one place doesn't work as well, try another one. Because I got much better sleep last night using the silent nights on the right side. Exactly. Playing around with Eon, uh, Alavita, and uh, sometimes X39 is wonderful for that as well. Yes. And Michelle, I'll tell it again. The right <laughs> temple um, has been known to help with snoring issues. Silent night on the right temple. Oh. And you did mention uh, putting stories up in Vibrant Living, and I want to remind people that, hey, we have a contest going, and if your story's in there, your name goes in there, and we're going to do a spin, and we're giving away a free uh, book on network marketing to help us, you know, keep helping people. So get your stories in Vibrant Living and in Live Younger. In Vibrant Living, you cannot name the patch nor the company because it's meant to just share stories and other people see them. And then they, you know, you get a little notification going, hey, your person just uh, saw a story on sleep and they need some help. So it's a way to get people. I have a couple good distributors out of it. So I highly recommend it. And then the other one is Live Younger, where you can name the patch. So just a, a friendly reminder of our tools out there. Beautiful. Thank you, Helen. Um, I just want to say one thing about the allergy. Someone, Bill, said um, using ice wave on either side of the nostril. So I'm guessing it's like the sinus points. So, Kay, there's another suggestion for allergies. Okay, here. Oh, right here next to the nose. Oh, okay. Thanks, Bill. All right. And we have several new people. Um, welcome to um, Margaret. Welcome to Janet Asher, um, and if you, if any of you want to speak up one of these times, we would love to hear from you. And when once you've had some experiences with the patches, so I think we're at the bottom of the hour. And uh, Gregory, if you want to share what's happening on tonight's meeting, be happy to. Okay. And what a great call! Glad we got the echo fixed. And I must confess, I figured out it was me. I had. It was playing in the background on our Facebook group. <laughs> so, so apologize for that. Lesson, le technology lesson learned. Yay. Okay. okay. So, uh, but yeah, we got a special call coming up tonight. You know, success does leave clues and we've got a lot of success happening. You know, November, the biggest month in the company history. Uh, this Saturday, David Schmidt did a wonderful Zoom and it's available on our Facebook, our Live Younger Facebook group for, for replay. He, he kind of went through this, the same slides he did at the conference, but he added a little bit more, another dimension to it. And it's always good to hear things twice, thrice, or many times with David, because there's so much in there. So I encourage everyone to go back and listen to it. It's now available. We'll get that added to our, our um, YouTube channel very soon also. But tonight, we're excited we get to celebrate a new presidential director out of our group here, and that's Connie Lucas. Uh, she crossed the finish line on, on Sunday, Saturday or Sunday. Robin and her were back and forth, back and forth, back and forth, and she just crested over the edge. So 100,000 points in, in volume over a four-week period. So Connie's a new presidential and uh, got quite a momentum going in her group, like many of you do, and we all can. And uh, so I'm very excited about that. And uh, also this week, we're going to be talking about uh, how to end 2021 strong and start 2022. And those of you who've been around uh, know that Robin has created these questions, you know, and, and this is a really good time of year to kind of stop, ponder, look back in the rearview mirror and, you know, and ask yourself some questions and are any dangling participles from 2021 that you'd feel relieved and you know ready to better more ready to move forward into 2022 if you took care of that's one thing and then you know get out the crystal ball get out you know the magic wand what do you want to create in 2022 for you and your family and community and we're going to be sending out these powerful questions that Robin has developed over the years and she's been sharing them with friends family and community for over 30 years. Robin, I don't know if you're there, if you want to say anything about that or 
We'll save that for tonight because I'm we'll here. I've you. been here the whole time. Oh, there she is. Hey there. <laughs> yep, yep, yep. Well, uh, that was a wonderful call, everyone. And yes, welcome all, all of you that are new and growing. And um, <clears throat> it was quite a week. <laughs> There's a lot of people broke some personal records and um, in an hour, you're going to get a notice from the company that there's another very exciting special coming on um, and it'll be uh, available in the US, Europe and Turkey. And um, and yes, the continual reminder that X49 is in pre-launch, January, all the registration should be done for everybody to get it. But um it will be a, a special for a few countries starting. And the, the questions, yeah, it's this is a personal ritual of mine for I think it's close to 40 years now. And it's, you know, I have two two of these rituals that go together is the questions and also another ritual that those of you that have been around realize that, you know, ending the year and doing conscious completions can make a huge difference in how we start the new year. So this week on 30 Minutes of Wisdom, we have um, our coach and many of you have been joining in and working with her and she's going to um, really talk about conscious completions and ending strong. So between the, the questions that go out in the newsletter and the 30 minutes of wisdom this week, we're just helping everyone get ready and do a conscious completion and end strong so you can start strong. And uh, Gregory mentioned David and that recording is up. That was amazing. This week, LifeWave Connect David is doing X49, so um, it'll probably be very similar to what he did on Saturday. So go to the back office under events and register for LifeWave Connect either at 11 or 6 Pacific time on Wednesday for the X49 overview. And um, I'm excited to celebrate. It's really fun to see so much going on with so many people. And I wanna thank all of you that are working deep in your organization because this rank advancement promotion is giving us an amazing opportunity to dig deep because there's certain people that haven't been active, but we can work with the people below them or, um, and we're, lots of people are going for it this month. And that's very, very exciting. And just a reminder, when you get a rank, you have to maintain the rank. So it's important to have the, you know, the momentum in your business. Um, what else do we want to mention, Gregory? Uh, Robin, re really quick, before we leave the idea of what's happening this week, on Friday, the 30 minutes of wisdom, there are some people on this call that have never been on. So what's the link for that? And who is this speaker? Is it JJ? Yes. Oh, JJ, Joshua. Yay. Yeah. And okay. the link is in the newsletter. So make sure you're on the newsletter list, but it's uh, liveyoungerzoom.com on Friday morning at 8 a.m. Pacific. And uh, JJ will be with us. She's She continues to do her own personal work. She's had some major shifts on her own after taking a 40-day sabbatical. And we get the new improved version. So it's very, it's, she's in a new place. It's exciting. And it's, it's a personal ritual that I love sharing with everyone of, you know, really taking the time to do that conscious completion. So this is, you know, a really powerful time of the year to do reflection for self and for others. And it's a great time to connect with people with some of these questions. So we'll, we'll um, maybe talk a little bit more about it tonight. Okay. Beautiful. Thank you, Robin. Someone asked, what is the Facebook group? Live younger. And you need to be invited, correct? You need to be invited by your sponsor because um, it's a private Facebook group. Correct. So live younger with an exclamation point. Yes. So ask, your, ask your sponsor. You can actually uh, go to liveyoungerfb.com and request to be added. And then there's a ritual that the admins could let you in. But the best way, as you just said, Michelle, whenever everyone enrolls a new person, invite them to you, to the Facebook group. Friend them on Facebook first. You must be a friend. And then invite them to the, to the Live Younger Facebook group. Thank you, Gregory. Mm -hmm. All right, if everyone wants to unmute and we can say goodbye, thank you for a wonderful call this morning, everybody. Bye. Thank, you. thank you. All right. Great call. Bye-bye. Have you. a good day. Bye, everyone. Bye, everyone. You rock. Thank you. Thank you, Michelle. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you.
Keep on catching everybody. Okay. Have a great Spread day. Bye now. Bye. 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 <laughs>